Hi guys, it's super, super early in the morning. I am dead tired, I am going to work. But I wanted to, of course, open my advent calendar before. Okay, number seven, ooh. Ooh, you can see that. What could it be? I think it is a Swarm by Scott Westerfeld, if that's what it's called. <clears throat> Not Swarm, Nexus. I love mean Nexus. It's the least right series. It's Nexus by Scott Westerfeld. This is the third and final book in this series, which is called Zeros. It's about kids who get superpowers. It's also written with two other authors. I haven't started it yet, but I knew I had to pick it up because I love Scott Westerfeld in general. So I've just been collecting the whole series and I'm really excited to start it. So yeah, this is the as I said, third one in the series, I'm pretty sure. So that was really nice, 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 nice. As I said, I'm going to work now and I'm gonna be in until four. It's like super dark outside because it's not light yet and it's gonna be dark when I'm done as well. I'm going to sign in like right after work and then I'm going home, obviously. The clock in the kitchen, I have forgotten that that is wrong. So I thought I had like super good time. It's not like I had bad time, but I should, get going now so I need to stop talking to you guys just gonna say one last thing and that is that I finished Cocker Kingdom yesterday I forgot to tell you because I think it traumatized me and then I forgot about it and now I've started The Frost and the Dagger by Renee Adier which is the second book in the Wrath and Dawn duology so that's nice and I'm gonna listen to it while going to work and stuff so yeah but I gotta go now so I will to you guys later bye I'm home, I look at all the thingy thingies that was in the box set because I bought the box set of this series of the author of it. Jesus, that was a really bad explanation and she signed everything. I'm finally home after a really long day but I will update you guys a bit more later because right now I'm like in a really hazard place. I will show you everything and then yeah, poop. <laughs> We are watching Harry Potter and we <laughs> You guys watching, do you understand? How does it sound like? What's alone? You. No, seriously, what alone? What is alone? Or don't you want to say on cam? Your face. What do you think of the Avengers trailer? Mm, I don't know. I don't have any opinion on it, I guess. Who's your favorite Avenger? <clears throat> Spooderman. Spooderman? Who's that? My babe. So what do you want to watch in the cinema? If you're gonna go to the cinema ever? Death one. Death one? Death two. Death two? Or death tree. Death tree? Mm. Are they all running at the same time? <laughs> one, two, and three at the same time? That was intense. They just went all out, didn't they? Yes. We delivered our... Um, linguistics? Linguistics things today, so we're hoping that would be okay. Do something nice. Oh, Always cool. do something nice. No, we'll do something entertaining. Oh. I need thumbnail. I need clickbait. You have me. Don't need anything else. True. <laughs> I only move my hand, Gigi. <coughs> Gigi's clickbait. Gigi just went crazy. She went feral. What do you want to do now? Oh. Fart face. Fart face. You are a big fart face. Oh, holy night.
Fine. When did the TV turn off? Did you turn the TV off? No. What the fuck? We were watching a movie and then we took a break and then the TV was just off. I think this vlog is the vlog at the height of my vlog. Um, I was gonna say career, but it's not a career, so fuck that sentence. It's late, you're going to bed, and I still haven't talked about today, so I'm gonna do it a bit now. Erica, do you really wanna listen to this? So, as you know, I went to work and then I went to a signing where I met Celie Patterson. Pictures inserted here, so you can see that I actually met her. She was just so nice and she signed all my books and she was just the sweetest and she writes if you don't know this series called the raven rings it's norwegian series and you should definitely check it out if it ever comes in to English, into English, translated into English. Obviously I have number one. This I brought from home, number one. And number two, which is my favorite. And number three, which was already signed because I got it for Christmas signed, but she like double signed for me. This is called The Bubble and it's like a standalone that's also by her, which I also have. So I brought all of those and she was really happy and she was so sweet. I'm sorry, I'm fine going. But then my friends, um, something else happened. There is this, I can say, collective box set of the Raymond Ring series that was there, which was really expensive. But guess who bought it? Me. I can't even lift it up, it's so heavy. But it's this beautiful black box here that's uh, in this great light. You can't really properly see, but that's fine. And inside, I'm not gonna take everything out, but inside there is uh, all three books in this one book here, which she signed. And there's three different notebooks with different exclusive content in them and she signed all of those as well oh god i'm zooming in my accent then there's this necklace here and then there's like maps and other things in this one i'm just i'm too lazy to take it all out but it's just beautiful and just i'm dead and also Gigi is like super cute lying there the whole reason she was actually signing is because this comic here that she wrote a few years ago came out in this physical copy so i just picked up that as well and she signed that of course as well we were like four people in line and she just used such a long time signing everything i just chatted with everyone in line at the same time and she was just the nicest and i probably was there for like 20 minutes just chatting while she signed all my things and i don't know we had a really nice conversation and i probably shouldn't repeat it all because that would be really boring but it was just the sweetest thing and i'm happy and now I talked about it so now we're all cool. What else is there to say? I don't know. I was at work today and I was thinking it would be ish chill, not like I'm not gonna do shit but I was like this will be an okay day but then there was like a million things to do so the time actually went super quickly but oh my god I'm tired. What's the plans for tomorrow? I'm going to work again, super boring, and I'm going to work like one o'clock, but I'm done seven, so it's like six hours. Only because the stores are open one hour longer because it's December and Christmas time. Erica, my dearest best friend, is going to a Christmas table with her work. So when I come home, she has like left, I guess, one, two hours ago or something. So I will be home alone then. And yeah, actually I won't be alone because Gigi's there and I can cuddle her. And I will actually try to read a bit because today I read six pages. Oh yay. The joy. <laughs> Queen of Iron Darkness did not arrive today either. Erica checked the mail for me while I was at work. And since I live in Norway, the mail is not delivered in the weekends, so it won't be here till Monday. I'm so sad about that because I thought that it would be her latest Wednesday or Thursday, but we are on Friday. So it's, I think it's really late and I was hoping I would finish the book until like Friday, Saturday, but now I haven't even started it and people have finished it and here I am. And it was even in the stores today because I was in the bookstore, right? It was there, but I already ordered my copy and I just, it sucked. Banana pee. <laughs> Was there anything more? I don't I don't think so. Today has been a lot of things happening, but very little on the camera. I am almost sorry. <laughs> Do you have anything to say before I end the vlog, Erica P? No. Are you okay? Uh -huh. Are you tired? Yeah. Jesus? She's so cute. Seriously. Thank you so much for watching this video and you will see me tomorrow with coolness and shit like that. Bye!